This video will be a short comparison with the GoPro underwater video quality using the standard housing that comes with the device versus the newly available dive housing. A lot of people have noticed and complained that the video quality underwater is not good with the standard HD housing, and that is because the uh, there's a lens effectively built into the standard housing. You can see the curved effect, and that lens is uh, designed to work in air. Uh, when we put water against that plastic, the index of refraction is different and does not focus the light properly. So to solve that problem, GoPro has come out with the dive housing, which has a flat surface, a flat glass surface, does not uh, in any way affect the light coming in underwater or above air, and allows the lens built into the uh, GoPro camera itself to do all the focusing. So I did this video comparison in a rather controlled manner, and I did it this way so that you can see a direct one-to-one -one comparison of the video quality using the two GoPro housings. Well, that's probably enough intro. So without further ado, here's a comparison of the underwater video quality using GoPro standard HD housing versus the dive housing. Okay, first up we have the GoPro standard HD housing, the one that comes with the HD Hero. Here you can see the video quality, the image blurriness due to the lack of ability to focus, independent of distance to the object. Up next we have the GoPro dive housing, and you can see the image quality here is much better, focused above water as well as below water, and that's uh, due to the flat glass surface which lets the lens in the GoPro camera itself do all the focusing. So if you care about the quality of your underwater video, and if you bought a GoPro, you probably do, I would spend the $50 and buy the GoPro dive housing or an equivalent third-party product.